video. Today we have, uh, if I can hold this up, every plate. So as you can tell by the title, we're going to be giving our honest review of every plate. Chris is here, he's working, so I am opening this. So I will preface this by saying that I scheduled for this to come on Wednesday. It came here on Tuesday. Um, I'm assuming that with everything going on in this world that I don't know. It just came early. I don't know. But I guess it's better to come early than to come late. So I'm hoping that everything, I mean, it, I, it feels cold. So I think it should be fun. I'm glad I went outside today because if not, I would have been expecting it to come tomorrow. But that is okay. I got it today. Um, so I will tell you guys what I got first before I open this. So I did the, so I had like a coupon. Um, so originally this two person plan, it comes with three recipes per week and with shipping and everything, it came to $40 without the discount. With the discount, um, it charged me $26.93. So, um, but I did order like a premium meal that they say is like an extra like $8 or something like that. I didn't get charged for that. So I think that they add that on later. So we'll see that charge comes in later but all right that's all the pricing and stuff so this is actually one of the cheapest meal delivery services I've seen so their meals without discounts normally is like five dollars per meal and a lot of other places I've seen is like ten dollars is like the average so this is like the most inexpensive meal plan so with all that being said let's see how they stack up I've never tried any other meal plans before. So I'm trying this one because this is the most affordable. So this is like my first ever meal delivery. So let us see what she's gonna try. So I can already see there are, there is a, a chill thing for insulation. So let's open this up. Okay, here are our recipe cards. So the meals that I chose were caramelized onion burgers. I don't know how well you're gonna see this, but once we start cooking them, cause we're not cooking this today, I'll show you more close ups, but I got the onion burgers. Then I got, this is the one that was like a premium meal thing. Um, it doesn't sit up here though, so I don't know. Maybe it's, I don't know. We shall see. Anyway, this is Steak frites. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right or wrong. I'm not really sure. Oh, I forgot to say the side. So this is the um, caramelized onion burgers with horseradish, aioli, and carrot fries. The steak frites is with green beans and roasted garlic butter. And this one also comes with potatoes. And then this one is creamy Dijon. Dijon. I think pronounce that right. Dijon. D Dijon. 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 There you go. <laughs> Dijon. Chris is correcting me. Creamy <laughs> Dijon chicken with sauteed zucchini and herby potatoes. So there we have that one. Alright, so this is how everything comes. So this looks like, oh, it feels cold. So I think we're good. This is the mustard. So, okay, so I have researched about this box and I know that one thing about this box is that a lot of the other meal delivery services, they put all of the recipes in different bags so that way you don't have to like figure out what goes with what. Because this box is cheaper, they put everything in one big bin. So, and I mean, if you read the recipe, you know what goes with what. So, here's the bin, if I can get this bin out. Okay, this is the bin. It has all the seasonings in it, it has all of the vegetables. I'm not gonna go too in depth because it's in a bin. It even came with like the condiments, the mayonnaise. It came with an onion in here. Maybe I should sit this down so I can actually show you guys what's in here. Uno momento, uno, uno momento. Okay, so. I think these are green onions. Then we have all of our different seasonings in here. So it's like, it's just like a bin. 
It's literally a bin. And it has all of our non meats. So this is like our produce stuff. So this is for like the burgers, it seems. We've got the onion and the shallots and we've got the carrots. We've got the green beans in here. These are, this is a lot of carrots. I guess because it's carrot fries. We've got, I think, zucchini. This has a, um, I don't even know what this is, a block of ice. And it says cut the corner and empty the non-toxic contents into trash and you can recycle the plastic of this. So that's cool. So then it has all of our meats in here and they're well cool. insulated. So we have our ground beef, cool? which, yeah, they're cool. Wait, wasn't ground, ground beef too cool? Uh, <laughs> this is for our burgers. I don't know. <laughs> This should be fine. I mean, it's 85% lean, 15% fat. Ground beef. Then we have our beef ranch steak. So this is for the one that was supposed to be more, but they still have yet to charge me the extra fee for the premium meal. So I don't even know. I, this is my first time doing it. So I'll let you guys know if they ever do charge me extra for this, but this is for our steak frites and then we have our chicken breasts the one concern I do have about this kit is whether or not this is gonna be enough food for both me and Chris um, so we will definitely be completely honest as for the serving sizes of everything but that's everything that came in here and I'm excited to see how this turns out because if these kits you know this meal delivery thing works out then this is something that we can incorporate into our daily lives so it's not something i would get like every single day because i like cooking and i like having you know my own recipes and stuff but i think the cool thing about this is that we can try out new recipes i've never had i don't want to say this wrong dijon is that right Dijon, is that no, right? It's not John, it's Jean. Whatever, I've never had Dijon. honey mustard chicken before. No, it's so, not honey mustard chicken. It's whatever, you literally say I it can't normally. say it. I've said it normally. All so the some, like, I just like that we can try out new recipes. And even if we think that the serving sizes here aren't the best, um, then we can just keep the recipes and we so can make them ourselves. It's the grade mm. on this steak. Oh my God. See, I've been this is the see, he's gonna be the heavy critic for sure. What's the grade? Is it choice? Is it? Is it, it says select? it says that it's um. Is it prime? Um, I don't know. It's not prime. It, if anything, it's trying to select or choice. But this meal, this meal right here, like what I was telling them, is supposed to be one of their premium meals. So for their premium meals, you have to pay what extra. Steak? Yeah, you have to pay extra like eight dollars. So something. that thing is supposed to be that. Yeah, I guess you slice it up. I have no idea how it's going to turn into that. We're going to read the recipes and figure Wait, it out. Wait, is there multiple of those? No, it's just one. That's what I'm saying. For both of us. So That's we, for both of us? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. This man right here will eat this entire thing of steak. He can eat this whole thing by himself. What? But we will find out if these serving sizes are enough for both of us. Now, those, those buns look good for both yeah, of us. Yeah, for the, for the burgers. But. Well, two burgers, but... We'll see. We'll see how this goes. Throughout this week, we're going to be trying these meals. And yeah. Cue the first meal. All right, guys. Day one of cooking an every plate meal. So, we're doing this very casually. I don't feel like setting up a camera. Chris is here with me. We're going to cook together. No, I can't see that. It's, it's been copyrighted. All right, anyway. So, what up, guys? today, babe, what are we cooking? We're cooking everyday plates. No. Oh, wow. <laughs> First <laughs> off, it's not every. He keeps calling it everyday plates. It's every plate. Every anyway, plate. Anyway, what are we cooking, babe? Every plate. You guys didn't sponsor we, this, so I'm going to mess with your are, name. What, what are we cooking? Steak. Oh, my gosh. We're cooking steak <laughs> frites. So, here Where's we have. steak frites? Here we have all our ingredients. Let me show you. Okay, these are all of our ingredients. We have our paper. Got our green beans, our steak, our seasonings, our shallots. They said one in the thing, but there's this feels like two shallots to me. So we'll just use all of it. And potatoes. 
so we're gonna just literally go through what it tells us to do and we'll come back to you when everything is complete right babe right all right starving so i'm ready man we gotta we gotta keep this quick this is our meal here my husband prepared the steak we both did the potatoes together and hers is um, medium well mine's is medium the way i like it we cooked it a little less than we normally would have, but no that's how it's supposed to be cooked I don't know they told us three to five minutes so we we might have cooked a little bit longer than that but we were trying to keep everything to like oh, yeah, it been their directions you know to really give a true taste test so without further ado we're gonna taste test and tell you how it is all right oh, we we're gonna pray. let chris give his taste test first okay. but yes we're gonna pray Amen. All right. All right. Now. Gentlemen first. We're going to let the husband try this first. And then after we're done eating, My we're going to say whether or not this is enough food. My first victim. So we're going to let him try everything. I have to sit here and just watch. This is just sad. But My first victim. This is so what you say this is? Garlic butter? So there's garlic butter on top of the steak. Oh, don't knock the other steak, babe. The other steak's about to fall off the plate. That's why I'm trying to <laughs> Butter knife is not what you should be using. Probably not. Knife, but but we kind of did, you know, it's we still kind of, kind of smooth like we butter. We use a lot of utensils to oh, use. Alright, don't take forever because I'm hungry. Mm. Mm. Is that good? Yeah? Oh, yeah. Yeah? It's like a prime rib. Okay, try everything else so that I can get a taste oh. test. I just want to keep eating the meat. <laughs> Oh. We'll get everything. Oh, wait. I forgot the mayonnaise. Hold up. Eat the green beans. Vlog yourselves. Mayo mush. Guys, <laughs> I was skeptical of this ranch steak because I thought it was too tiny. But this thing is juicy. Try your green beans. Huh? Got some caramelized onions. Nice color. Mmm. Good. good. I wish there was more of a crunch. Ooh, there's the chili. Yeah, I cooked them longer than they told me to. because I, thought I wish there was more crunch. So you want it to be more crunch? Yeah. I'm giving him mayonnaise because they say the right. fries are supposed to have mayonnaise. Okay, try the fries. I was going to use the mayo mustard. Huh. Oh, well. At least try it like that first. And then... Let's see. Mmm. Good. Also good flavor. Like, even though it looked like we put a lot of seasoning, it's pretty delicious. Okay, okay. Ah. video take me. Ah. take forever to taste Your turn. This, and I want to try it. Meanwhile, I'm over here watching him eat, and I'm starving. Let's We're probably not going to do this in depth of taste test for the other meals, but... <laughs> or, you know, I don't know. It's our first one. Okay. Let's try it. Without further ado. Yeah. Oh good. It's juicy, right? So good. I'm still gonna be tasting. I'm <laughs> about to eat. Okay, let's try. Well to my defense, you told me not to use the fries. Potato. You told me not to eat the uh, potato fries. Mm. Yeah, right? It's nice. It's like, like even that. though we use a bunch of seasoning, it still has a good flavor. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's try the uh -huh. green beans. Green beans going in. Oh, I need oh. an onion. Onion. Get those caramelized onions. Yeah, they are caramelized. Actually, they're shallots. They're not onions. We call them mm. onions. Yeah? I like the way the shallots taste. Yo, that, those green beans are bomb. Yeah. Oh, no, this is delicious. So, yeah. at the end of this whole thing, we'll let you know if these serving sizes are good. But for tonight, we are pleased with our meal. So, we're going to finish yeah. eating our meal. And uh, we'll check back in with you when we have our next meal. All right, we're gonna taste test this meal we have here and see how it is. Do you wanna go first? Mm, please, first. Mm -hmm. High mustard chicken. Cheers. Mm. That's really good. 
They had extra sauce, so I put it on all the other stuff. Even though I don't think it's supposed to. I will say all these meals are really, like, tasty. pieces are always the best. So wait, is this scallions? It's got scallions. green stuff. <laughs> Not bad. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'm more of a beef guy, but, you know. For chicken, I'm a good chicken. It's juicy. Oh, I'm supposed to eat all stuff, huh? Yeah. <laughs> He's hungry. It's okay. What's this plate full of green stuff? Zucchini. He's not a vegetable person. I force him to eat vegetables. He likes salads now, though. I converted him. I like zucchini and hibachi. That's good, right? I keep eating it thinking about that face. I keep eating it thinking of hibachi. It doesn't taste like hibachi. Okay, try the potatoes so we can eat our dinner. Okay. I like those. Hmm? I like those. I like those better than the chicken. Yeah, I think I just mm -hmm. like the serving sizes are small. Like I put on this teeny tiny plate. Yeah. But the potatoes are just, I think, the smallest serving size they get you. Yeah. Maybe it's like they're telling you to not eat carbohydrates. I love the crispiness on that. But I think that these, I think what I figured out, I think these portions are more for lunch. Because at lunch, you yeah. don't really eat as much as dinner. Yeah, maybe. For some people. I don't know. Oh. Anyway, we're going to enjoy our food. Mm. We didn't rate it. Oh. I'm supposed to rate it. I don't know. I think we just know. rated as good or not good, but we said it was good, so. I'll give it a thumbs up. Thumbs up from the husband. Should I try the fries first or the carrots first? No, it's up to you. Or I'll try them plain. <sighs> Tastes like carrots. Yeah. Now, Chris loves his mayo must. I love the mayo must. It's, it's kind of like so honey mustard. Good. Yeah, like. Honey mustard and mayo had a baby. Yeah, you like, want to pair it with that. Alright. Oh, snap. Nice and juicy. I like how you didn't skip out on the meat, too. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look mm. at that. Ooh, nice and medium well burger, too. Good job. Mmm. Wow. Mm, good. You're going to be making the burgers from now on. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Alright. Go ahead and try it out. I'm going for the burger first. <laughs> oh, true. Try to be different, you know? It's not because I want to eat the burgers first. Okay. Yeah, mm. look at that shot. I think we both have mayonnaise on our... <laughs> Isn't that good? Oh, yeah. Medium well, too. That is really good. This is a really good job on the burger. You think? This I is like restaurant good. quality. I'm not just trying to like, zoom in. Look at the juiciness. Hey. That's really good. Okay, try the carrots and finish our meal. Mm. I'm gonna <laughs> eat the good burger. <laughs> Look at your mouth. Oh. There you go. <laughs> you got something? Did I get? Yes. Yeah. This is weird. Carrot fries. It's just a different way to eat it. Yeah. Tastes like a carrot. Tastes like a carrot. <laughs> but it's good with the mayo must, though. It's weird because it's like, it's an in-between between, you know how fries, potato fries, they don't have any taste? Yeah. And then sweet potato pies, they have like a taste. Mm -hmm. It's like a mix Makes between it. those two. Like, it's, it's not like bad, but with the mayo must, it's pretty, actually pretty good. It's like, it has, a, it has a sight of sweet potato fries, but it tastes like a regular potato fry. Like, just, it's a carrot. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. I don't know, it tastes like a carrot to me. So it's good with that, though. Oh, yeah. I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm convinced that. anything paired with this But I think this is actually a good idea. Like, I'm mm. going to actually start making carrot fries so I don't cut back on the carbs. Yeah, because, I mean, I mean, it's just like sweet potato fries, bro. Yeah. 
Okay, let's give our last final thoughts. We might as well. So what are your final thoughts of, uh, well, actually, you know what? Let's get together. All right, as you eat your carrot fries, what are your final thoughts <laughs> of every plate? I think that this is good for teaching you portion control. Mm -hmm. That's my biggest thing. Because it's like, there was a couple times where I was like, I wish I had more. Yeah. But I definitely felt satisfied. Yeah. So, and I would pick being satisfied over being full any day. Just because, well, one, keeps me f not fat. <laughs> Two, um, it's a good meal. You know, yeah. what could you ask for? You know? I will say the meals are really good. Like, yeah. the flavors and stuff they have for these meals are really good. And it teaches you how to cook, too. Yeah, I like it because, like, the first time we were able to cook together, and it's cool, you know, doing new recipes and stuff, yeah, and... Easy. No, you didn't. You just had work and stuff. But anyway, yeah. so it's cool to learn new recipes. Um, like Chris said, I think for us, we just eat more than one serving. Like, this is a true, like, one serving for each person, and we just eat more than that. So we just, we're snackers. That's really, that's, that's not on them. That's on us. But anybody trying to do a diet... I definitely would suggest I will doing say this. though they could give you more potatoes now I will say what? that the potato those fries we had the first yeah, yeah like they could give you one extra potato per person I think like that was a very small have some potatoes on deck <laughs> you want, you want I know I guess I could have added some extra but I was really trying to test out the recipes but all in all they're really good delivery service and I would definitely order them again yeah yeah I well, think you did. <laughs> I did. I got. I had discounts. So yeah. anyway, I will. Like I said at the beginning of this video, I will um, link the discount. It's like twenty dollars off your first week or something like that. And I'll link it down for you guys. Hey guys, Future Jasmine here. I just wanted to make one more comment before this video is over. I want to say that one downside that I have noticed after using every plate for about a month or so is that um, their delivery process, the way that they package their materials and ship it, isn't the most secure. So there was one instance where something in the shipping got smashed, but they were really kind. I, I called them up and I was able to get my a discount on my next box so i would say that that is a downside because the way that they package it is more cost effective they put it in the bin and in the bottom they have the meats and stuff but there's a possibility that it could get mashed now it's not something that happens frequently i've had plenty of boxes that have been perfectly fine but that's some that is a downside that i have noticed and i wanted to mention here yeah try it yep pretty good good job baby Billy. I'm proud of my burger skills. But we're going to eat now. Yep. We hope you guys Probably enjoyed this video. And uh, we will see you in another one. Deuces.